guys thank you so much for being here today I know it's been a long time since I did a video like this it's probably been a really long time since I did a video without any cars or anything it's been highly requested that I stop using the cards so I'm not gonna do something that you guys aren't enjoying so I'm going to just do a traditional video that I, I don't even know what to say I haven't done a video in so long but I'm gonna do a video the way I used to do it and um, yeah I just want to also say that the cards were I don't want to say they were making me lazy but they were making things a lot easier but I knew I had to like try them out and see how everybody felt about them before I um, just continued to do the readings the way I was doing because in my mind I was saying to myself that maybe the cards would help me deliver a better message. Now the majority of people have told me that that's not really the case. So I want to let you guys know that I'm going to continue to do my readings the way I have traditionally. I am not going to get rid of the cards, but the cards are going to help diversify pricing. And I think that's going to be really good. So I'm excited about that. And yeah, we're going to continue. So I'm going to be doing a psychic reading today using a picture. If you guys know how I do readings, I use pictures of people. We're going to be doing a psychic reading on Chase, Chase Stokes and Madeline Klein. Uh, these two have been together for about a year. They've broken up, I believe, in 2021. Uh, back in November, they broke up. All right, the energy I'm getting from Chase is that he is very, like, control freaky. He might have OCD as well. I, I'm getting that this is type of, this is the type of person. Um, all right, a lot of messages are coming at once. I'm hearing German ancestry. I don't know if you guys know anything about this. I'm hearing he's also had a past life with um, some type of high regard in Germany. They're showing me like a lot of royalty around him. He might have been a prince. He could have been something along those lines. He could possibly have some royal ties now if anybody is into like searching genealogy if you know any information about that you guys could definitely comment that below people will definitely um go crazy over that stuff so if you know anything about that comment but i am hearing that this is a royal bloodline type of thing that he has going on here and he's had past lives in germany too as we're speaking there's two people hovering over me behind me if you could feel that so there's a few messages coming from him he has a lot of uh, energy to him and there's definitely a lot of protection around him as well now I feel like these are people the people that are watching me do this reading have been following him from a past life it's almost like I'm I'm getting like the feeling it, it's almost like a night protection energy you know the knights they were always in like the hell is that called iron I guess that's what I'm seeing in my head it's kind of like these people might have died serving him in a past life and they're still spiritually protecting him okay so that's what i'm getting i feel like this person was very anal he is in this day very anal about details um i don't know if he's foreign i i don't know but i feel like i, I could hear him like speaking a certain language so this could be past life stuff i'm not 100 percent sure i don't know everything about this person but i am getting um some type of foreign royalty behind him okay so i'm gonna look at madeline signs line right now um I'm sure you guys are wondering if they're soulmates i'm not necessarily getting much um i'm not even a hundred percent convinced this is like one of those pr relationship type of ordeals because i'm getting that they're friends so they have a friendship together I, I don't feel exactly like they were either of each other's types when they got together. Um, I'm not saying that they're lying about being in a relationship or when they were in a relationship, but I do feel like these people are very different. He is very articulate and like he wants things a certain way. She's more laid back. Um, I'm not sure if she could be possibly like a Taurus rising. I'm not necessarily getting that much energy 
from Madeline. I feel like she is very secretive. I'm also hearing that she may have a um, like sorcery energy within her or she could come from a background. Somebody might be praying for her. But I'm getting a lot of mystery. I'm also hearing that there's some witchcraft over here. This could be past life. This could be something that's put her in situations which she may have not normally been in, which is, you know, that's usually what you will see if you read somebody who's a natural born witch, that they may start off in a situation where they were very poor and then they're very wealthy. So that's kind of the energy I'm getting for Madeline. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing her name right. And for him, he kind of wears it all on his sleeve, whereas she's more reserved, mysterious. Um, obviously, I can read her, but there are a lot of secrets here. And she also, her personality is reserved as well. Okay? Um, she also doesn't really like people knowing a lot about her. I feel like she may have other talents or... She could be talented in more ways than one, but she doesn't like telling people. She doesn't want people to know everything about her. Very different people. I also feel like he was not necessarily in a bad way, but he is more egotistic than she is. She is more quiet, reserved, as I already stated. I'm hearing the word she's very introspective <laughs> she also I'm, I'm as i'm connecting with her energy and her spirit she doesn't necessarily want people to know how she truly felt about him so it's hard for me to understand things from her perspective from his again just not getting this is not somebody who's crazy in love with her like I said, these people have been broken up for a while, but I'm just not even getting that much energy from them in, in the past either. So I do feel like this could have been a contractual thing, not necessarily discounting that they may have had a relationship. I'm just seeing this is not necessarily like the deepest relationship. I do feel like there is a friendship coming from them. So, okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I know this is a little shorter than usual. But I hope you enjoyed this reading. I'm going to try and get more out this week. And yeah, definitely comment below who you want me to read next. I have um, an Instagram poll up right now. Uh, we are doing rituals, group rituals. They're 50% off using the code LEOVDAY in all caps for the rest of the week. And we have some really good rituals going on right now. If you guys want your own reading, you can contact me below or you can schedule me below. Um, in the app that says venusconjure.asme. Okay, guys. Bye.